changing out these tubes on these uh, R tube microphone preamps is really, really a simple little deal. I did this last night. It only took about 10 minutes, but I didn't want to record it. I just thought I'd talk about it. But here's the stock Chinese, if you will, cheaper tube. And just the way I'm holding it right here like this is just kind of how it sets. Can you see this grate right back here? That's where the Russian-made electroharmonics tube is setting right now. Uh, let me set this tube off. A, well, let me say this real quick. Like, There's nine pins on here, and there's no way you can get anything mixed up because there's a gap. In, in, in other words, some um, pins aren't uniform. So she plugs in pretty only one way, if you will. And so the box, I can't show you the tube, the Russian-made tube. This 12AX7 here, but it, I can't show you the box anyway. <laughs> to get things turned around and going my way there. Now this this particular tube here is what exactly what you're listening to. It's got pretty good reviews and whatnot, have you? So, but in order to change that tube out, all you have to do. Let me just flip this unit over here. Okay, there's two screws. Can you see them? They're right there in the middle of your screen, okay? You're going to have to use a small, fairly decent uh, Phillips screwdriver because those screws are kind of tiny. You want to make sure you use a screwdriver that fits. The um, screws are only about eighth of an inch long or maybe a little longer than that. They're pretty small. You got two there, okay? And you got two, let me slide this over here, but you got two on the other side. You take those four screws out. And basically what happens is the top and the bottom, they're married together, but they're only married together by those uh, flat ribbon cables that go up to some of the controls here, the switches and whatnot. But basically you just kind of clamshell it or slightly pry the top off and it gives you plenty enough room to just plug the, plug the new tube in, if you will, and you know, Kind of be careful of those ribbon cables and just fold the top back down again and realign the holes and put the four screws in and you're you're back in business and so and that that's really basically all there is to this operation and like I say this is the uh, the stock tube that came with it and I I don't know if you can hear any difference from my other videos or not here but I am about three feet away from this mic so. I realize this is a short video, but it's just a real small little project changing tubes out on this Art Tube MP Studio microphone preamp. Thank you very much for watching the video, and have a nice day.